Night on Big Brother. It's the final nominations. She's patronising. She's devious. Two-faced. Lazy. Heartless. Is he my friend or is he not? She's doing me out in pen coat. The housemates nominated for eviction this week are... Oh, fuck off. It's not a battle anymore, Denise. Oh, Lukey, you are so blind. This is the final wait. Do we care? No. And Scott confesses. I have to tell you. Just tell us. It was a task the whole series, the whole show. Try and help me get through to the final week. <gasps> wow. Oh, my God. Okay, so they, like the joke was basically on everyone else. Yeah. So basically, we don't know what you're like after two months. We don't know the real you. Yeah, I have been the real me. I would never ever do that. That makes you guys gullible or what? So angry. I don't know whether it's right to do it. Dear 63, 9.31 a.m. They've lived in the house for 10 weeks and there's only one thing that stands between the housemates and the final. This is Big Brother. Nominations will take place in one hour. This will be the final time that you nominate. As he has won a pass guaranteeing a place in the final, Lucas can nominate but cannot be nominated. Who will face the public vote this week? Case or R to R. I hate that song. Nothing to do with case da da da. You make your own future. You sit in your ass every day and don't do anything. There's no case da da da. You're gonna be fucked, really, ain't you? Some porridge in my tummy, waiting to face the battle mm. today. It's not a battle anymore, Dean's. Oh, Lukey. It's not. You are so blind, but yet so lovable. <laughs> Being honest. I think it was, Hi but it's not anymore. Mm -hmm. There's no divide now. We're going to have to beg to differ on this one. Fact is, it's still there. Ten thirty-two a.m. Dina has a pet name for Luke S. It's Willy Wonka. They've got the golden ticket in Charlie the Chocolate Factory, haven't they? Yes. Oh, I'm going to start calling you Charlie. Charlie. Can't respond to Charlie, Charlie, I want the gold ticket. I want it, Charlie. Charlie, can I have the gold ticket? Please. Why have you got a gold ticket? Charlie, I really want the gold ticket. Can I have it, please? Well, the gold ticket, it gets you somewhere. Seven days time. Oh, right, okay. I Charlie, I'll buy it <laughs> off you. Please, 50k. <laughs> <laughs> Ashley is first to the diary room to make her nominations. My first nomination is obviously Dina. She's getting more of an attitude on her and I don't like it. Um, you know, she's just, she's patronising, she's devious and, and I just can't be bothered to be in the house with her anymore. She said she can't deal with all this bullshit in this house. She's going to come out of her shell more. So if that's coming out of her shell, I don't want to speak to her, to be honest with you. I just don't like her. I mean, yeah, there is a potential that Arthur Lewis could be out. Yes. Um, but there's, if we all... Um, um, did he get that? Yeah. Yeah, so... Mm. Um, what was I going to say? Okay, my second nomination would be Adam, purely because when I said to him about the 50 grand, um, and I said, I don't really care about it, to be honest with you, and he was like, how can you not care it's 50 grand, like proper snapped at me. I was just like, but at the end of the day, Adam, 50 grand 
doesn't, it, you know, the experience is priceless. 50 grand can't buy Big Brother what you've, what you've done in this show, you know, it's, you just can't. It was like he was making me feel guilty because I wasn't bothered about how much money Connor took. I'm glad Connor's took that money. To me, like, it do money doesn't mean everything to me. My first nomination is Ashley. Because I find Ashley very selfish and two-faced. And I feel like for the whole two months, even when me and Ashley do have an agreement, usually I go up to her and I say, come on, let's forget it. We can just, just forget it, whatever. We can still be civil to each other. And then I think everything's fine. And then I hear from someone that she's bitching about me again. So it's, I've just realised now, there's no point even trying with her because she's always going to be that way. My second nomination is Scott because he never made effort with me when Connor and Becky was here. He stayed away from me. I, I remember I used to try and talk to him and he just used to dismiss me. But now because his friends have left, now he's choosing to have conversations with me. And I'm also seeing new things. Like, I think he's actually been very clever. Like, now he's getting a bit worried in case he might be put up. So last night, you know, he stayed up late talking to me and talking to Adam and talking to Luke, which he never usually does. And then, you know, he was talking to Ashley last night about me. He told me that he defended me to Ashley, but I'm, I'm still not a bit sure. But it's, it's too late for that now, because he should have done that weeks ago. Coming up, nominations continue. Well, this is quite a tricky little number, this one. No, we don't have loads in common. She she keeps trying to wind me up. In the last couple of days, I've just kind of seen things that I haven't really liked. And Scott's revelation shocks the house. I'm a bit nervous about telling you because it involves a bit of deception, really. No way. One twenty-seven p.m. Adam's looking for some support. I put a bra on yesterday. That was nothing. That was back Technically, you actually put a bikini top on. I tried to and I couldn't figure it out. So, <laughs> my name is Adam, and I love wearing women's clothes. Yeah. So <laughs> you know, and the sad part is, is that I needed a bigger bra. Definitely. <laughs> saying, my C cups. Hanging tough. <laughs> what would you say? What kind of bra size would you say you are? A C cup of something. No, more than that. Really? You think I'm working with some double D's I think over you're working here? like a double D. <laughs> oh, gotcha. No. Yeah. No. Mine's a double D. I do not have no double D titty. Okay, Anyone okay. wants to find out? Let's try it. <laughs> It's the final nominations, dear, and so far, Dina, Adam, Ashley and Scott have received one nomination each. Scott is next in the diary room. OK, my first nomination is for Adam. He's one person who I don't have a very free-flowing fun conversation with and so maybe when I'm just sat with him on my own it's ro a little bit uncomfortable because I don't know what to say to him and also he loves to stare so you've got two enormous dinner plate eyes glaring into you when you're just trying to go about your business so that's why okay the second nomination um oh no Okay then, well, this is a terrible, terrible thing because it's someone who I like. Scott, if you could give the name of your second nomination. I don't know whether it's right to do it. 
well, okay, this is the one that comes to my mind, and it's not good, but it will have to be done. Okay, my second nomination is Sara. Well, oh my lord. It can't be, what do you think? Do you think that's really awful? Because I've been nominating my friend, but she seems to be blowing hot and cold. Well, last night I thought she hated me. So that's why. Why did you think she hated you? Because she was being really off with me and looking at me in a sort of horrid way. <sighs> this is, no, I don't, I can't do it. No, I can't do that. Oh, OK, it's not, so it can't be her, that's... Scott, are you nominating Sarah, or would you like to change your second nomination? Don't know what to do. Scott is giving it to him. <laughs> Can you imagine how that... Hmm. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> <laughs> <laughs> okay. My second nomination is Dina because sometimes she's upset people and I don't think I think everyone should be equal in the house and no one should be talked down to. And I know it is a joke and and banterous and all that. But if it is upsetting someone and you know it and then you carry on taking it too far, that can be a little heartless. And then um also, when she's going on about soldiers, 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 it's so cringeworthy. Please stop calling each other soldiers. It's so cringy. My first nomination's Scott. I love him to bits and he's one of my best friends in here. But over the last couple of days, I've seen kind of like a little bit of a bitchy side to him. I don't think he's been talking behind people behind their backs because he is honest. It's just in the last couple of days, I've just kind of seen things that I haven't really liked. But I still really, really like him, and he's still one of my really, really close friends. And I feel terrible for doing this, but I need to give a reason. My second nomination is Adam, because I got on so well with him, and I really, really value his friendship. But then there's just been things in the past and stuff that he's said, which I don't really understand why he said it. And I think, mm, are you playing a game or not? There's been times before where I've thought that, is he my friend or is he not? Or sometimes when you say something to him, he'll sometimes turn it round and make it you to kind of look bad. And I know how much he wants to win. Two ten pm Ashley thinks she's got her nominators sussed. The funny thing is, like... Dana, she's already 100% done it to me, but 100%. Oh, by, oh, them three have. Uh, yes, they've egged you in the street before. <laughs> no. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter anyway, but, like, they, they obviously have. <laughs> yeah, right? they've, so then, they've no, but, stolen your drink before. Yeah, but, yeah. No, but, yeah, but who, who, who are they going to do it to? Well, oh, shut up, shut up, shut up. No. I can't discuss this. Mm. Why are you saying these things? Because it's true. I don't care. We're not allowed to talk about nominations. Yeah, but it's not, it's not exactly saying it. This is the final week. Do we care? No. I don't know. Why do we care? I don't. No. Adam is the next housemate to nominate. Um, first nomination is Ashley. Still got fucking chocolate in our fridge. She um, was in cahoots with Caroline to bring us all the chocolate and lied about it and then still acts selfish about everything. Um, second nomination would be Scott. Yesterday we all cleaned up and he decided not to and swim in the pool and he's lazy and he doesn't help clean. Luke, I know what we can play to be entertaining. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory! I want the ticket! I want the ticket! Can't wait to nominate your ass. I want the ticket! <laughs> eh, fuck off. Luke A is the penultimate housemate to nominate. Tough one this week, but my first nomination is Ashley. Because I find her a very selfish person. I don't appreciate the way 
you are in dis discussion and she'll disagree, say her opinion and then say 100% after it like her opinion is the only valid one. And her voice really grates me sometimes. This nomination is, is really tough for me because I've never had any issues with this person really. Um, but it's Scott. Yesterday we were all cleaning and stuff and you know everyone was chipping in and I looked in the hot tub and he was just sat there and then it reminded me of all the times that he hasn't really helped out in the house and he just seems to have got away with it. Also I find him a bit of a sort of turncoat, he seems to go to all the different groups of people and, and seems like he's playing a game. I don't want everyone to do that again. Numbs. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake, it makes me so stressed. Why? Because I don't know if my reasons are right. Like, well, you always say, if they're your opinions, then you feel it. Yeah, like, things like this I might not be right on. <sighs> oh, goodness knows. Oh, did you find it easy? Yeah. Oh, man. With four votes, Scott will definitely face the public vote, but Luke S will decide who joins him. Please could you give the name of your first nomination and explain your reasons for this nomination? Dina, because she's doing me head in recently. Dina out of everyone, I find more irritating, really. You know, we don't have loads in common, she, she keeps trying to wind me up <coughs> about what happened the other day and it's just like, you're doing me head in, like... I'm now Charlie out of Charlie the Chocolate Factory because I have a golden ticket. What do you want to do today, Charlie? Charlie this, Charlie that. Well, lo and behold, my name's actually Luke, not Charlie, so... Hmm. No thanks. Second nomination is... Luke A. Um, man, it's a difficult one, i say, like... <clears throat> out of all the people that are left in there... Like... I'd say I get on with more people better than Luke A. And obviously we've had our differences and stuff. Um, and probably both of our faults and stuff, but we just, uh, they've just never been mended. I don't hate the fellow, but I prefer some of the other people over him, unfortunately. Adam, Ashley and Dina all have three nominations and will join Scott in facing the public vote this week. Sarah was the only housemate to receive no nominations. Four or nine p.m. Scott is unaware that Big Brother is about to set him a secret mission, and Big Brother's starting it with an announcement to surprise the whole house. This is Big Brother. Congratulations, Scott. You have completed your mission. Please come to the diary room. What the fuck? Talking, yeah. talking shit That's about someone, probably. What was your secret mission? What was it? Was it... Dressing up as getting face painted. No. I'm sure, ah. like you said, the final what business. What? Well, probably like you're in the final. No, no. it's a mission. He's you think so? He's doing a task. What is it? I don't know. Oh. Hello, Scott. Oh. As you have just heard, you have completed your mission. Yes. Big Brother's biggest ever secret mission. Yes. Well, that's what the other housemates will think. Oh, right, OK. In fact, Big Brother's setting you a secret mission now. Oh, gee. OK. <sighs> In order to win a VIP party, for you and your friends tonight, mm -hmm. you must convince your fellow housemates that you have been working for Big Brother from day one. Right, OK. <laughs> OK. They must believe that Big Brother has been controlling you from day one, giving you instructions <coughs> to fail tasks, start arguments, and generally do whatever Big Brother wanted. Oh, <laughs> OK, yay! <laughs> This is fun. They must accept that your aim was to get to the final week. Right, OK. So let me just get all the stories ready before I go in. OK, the white room. I had um, Big Brother secretly told me beforehand that 
not to go in. <laughs> so that, yeah, so that I would have no opportunity to leave the house, so I'd have to make it to the final week, something like that. Okay, what other things can I say? The haircuts was, in fact, just Big Brother instructing me to to do it. Scott, you've convinced Big Brother. No, I've convinced myself, darling. <laughs> oh, my gosh. So scary. <laughs> I wonder what it is. There's nothing yeah. unusual. That is, normally, when people have secret tasks, I'm like, oh, yeah. But there's nothing... So Scott King, Scott does it. Scott's so... Peculiar, anyway. You just I don't know. I'm trying to think. What has he been saying? Has he hid anything or taken anything? Or because that would be easy. I'm just trying to think of everything he said. He's not brought anything up that he wouldn't normally speak about. There we go. What was your mission? Yeah. Happy day. What did you do? Yes. I passed it. What did you do? <laughs> Um, yes, how's it done? Just tell us. Okay, I'll tell you. Let's really just get some glasses. Aww. What's he done? <laughs> You're making it up. Like... Daddy. Oh, uh, yay! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what have you done, Scott? Okay, so, yeah. Should we all sit around and then I'll tell you? I'm a bit nervous about okay. telling you because it involved a bit of deception, really. It doesn't mm. matter. Like, the whole time. So, anyway, basically, um, they wanted to do something a bit different, so in like the first few days they come into the diary room and... Shit. And it was a task for the whole series, the whole show. No way. So basically along the way they would call me in and tell me about certain little things that I had to do to try and help me get through to the final week. Wow! <gasps> oh my God, okay, so they like, remember... <laughs> I'm so nervous about telling you. <laughs> and anyone else can help themselves. Remember the um, rap scallion incident? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, yeah, obviously, I love Darren and everything like that. But anyway, that day they called me in and said I had to have an argument with him that night and <laughs> used the word rap scallion. No <laughs> way. And um, I had to try and sabotage the, the laughing task. So that's why I was sat in the hot tub for ages with Bex uh -huh. and we were laughing all the time. <laughs> oh, wow. And. Well, and other arguments. Oh my god! So rap scallion wasn't even you. No, it's not even a word. They told me to, oh. I to use that yes. word. So that then I had my that best moment in the house. Yeah, I know. The rap scallion like, word. Do you feel better now that's off your shoulders? Yeah, it's obviously. <laughs> and then more generally, like I should never have like joined in any groups and stayed try to stay neutral. Yeah. And um, the hypnotism one. That secret party they told me in there, <laughs> and basically, like, I did actually know you all. <laughs> Earpieces Earpiece. and everything, and then it was basically just to put the joke on everyone else that so you'd have to do really embarrassing, yeah, like, yeah. impressions and stuff. Well, Tells you we look like fucking idiots yeah. doing yeah. this. Yeah, exactly. So <laughs> the joke was basically on everyone else. Yeah. So didn't you feel like you yes. wasn't being yourself? That's so funny. Didn't you feel a bit like you're not justifying Well, exactly. Your own That's why I got stressed sometimes. So didn't you say that you don't want to do it? No, that I had to do it. You had to do it, you had no choice. Yeah. So you wanted to do it. Yeah, and it would yeah. help me get to the final week anyway, so. Alright, so let's get to know the real Scotty now then. Yeah. Hey. yeah. <laughs> that's why, that's why in the debating task I got my topic and he got his topic. Mm hmm. Exactly, yeah. stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. That, oh, that makes sense. I can't remember all the stuff they told me. I can't remember. <laughs> I'll remember them. The all. easy ones were. So, <laughs> I feel just so bad. Like, but yeah. I can't understand why you'd want to like not be yourself just to get to the final. I don't understand how they don't think you were in a group though. What's well, no, right? They Obviously, you try. Very neutral. Like, well, you can only try your best. No, we did. The end of that not so really. Hard. So basically, we don't know what you're like after two months. We don't know the real you. Yeah, I have been the real me, but it's just certain things. Just certain to things you got coached through. Yeah. I, they haven't. Uh, still me, but certain things that they tell me what to do, <laughs> so... Coming up, Dina's not impressed with Scott. Well, anyone, anyone would want to get to the final yeah, week. I'm not going to turn okay. down the doors to do that, am I? I would have. And Scott gets a cheeky reward. Oh, my God! <laughs> I can't... I can't look. I'm going to Scott, look, look, look. Why? Leave me alone! <laughs> Four forty seven PM.
after Scott's made-up revelation that he's been involved in a series-long secret task, the housemates are still quizzing him. I haven't, like, it's been a completely idea. different person or anything like that. It's just, like, the odd incidents and stuff like that. It's not like they do it every day and everything like that. But then when they did do it, it, just, it was stressy, but mm. it wasn't, like, all the time. I'm not being, like, a different person or anything. Mm. But then... Yeah. You wasn't being fake or anything like that. No, no, I was just no, being myself. Being but yourself. certain things they just told me what to yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. Because I, like I was just saying in there, I don't know what the public, I don't know what the public like, whatever. So it's, uh, I don't know what they want to see. So I was just relying on them to tell me what to do. Mm. But I think what they told you to do wasn't for the public, but it was for the people inside the house, uh -huh. wasn't it? Ultimately, so we wouldn't know. have anything against you. It wasn't for the public. Yeah. I don't know, but anyway, I'm just looking forward to the reward. Uh. Is that why you didn't have to go in the white room, or was that your choice? Oh, in the white room, yeah. They tell me before that I shouldn't really... Well, go I shouldn't go in it. See? I shouldn't go in it, so there's no chance of me having to leave the house. Yeah. Wow. See, you designed. What a shock. What a shocker. So did you want to cut your hair, or was that... <gasps> the the hair thing! <laughs> that was a joke, on, I just thought no. that was a joke. What? No, the hair thing, like... They told you to cut your hair? That had to be another theme, the hair. Oh my god, no I said to you, I think way. you should cut your oh, hair. Shit, I was joking. I said, I think you should shave your hair off, and you did it. Like, the hair was a theme that I had to do as well. Oh so, god, what? They so said, crazy. cut your hair, or when someone mentioned it, you said you've got to cut your hair? They just said you have to do a, have to experiment with different styles of your hair that you wouldn't normally have. So, you went through So, yeah, I leapt on the opportunities. Yeah, so what I was saying to you, let's start your hair with so Yes, let's do it. That. Let's shave your hair. Let's just have done that at all. I had, to, I had to protest a little bit to make it seem. Fuck that, I wouldn't shave my head. Huh? But I would never shave, shave my head. head. Yeah, neither would I. Fuck I that. Like that. So but it is actually better. Yeah. I actually do like yeah. it, so... <laughs> what about, um... Yeah, of course we would have. Do you know what the public knew? I don't know anything. I don't know. I have no idea. It's cool. I love it. But that's why there'll be a special reward well. because it was like something they've never done before well. and like a... They've never done a, like a yeah. task for one person throughout the whole thing, so... That's why it's a special one and that's, that's why I'll get a good reward. What the hell, big brother? Sneaky little rat. They are sneaky. <laughs> oh, what? shit, but I feel really uh, bad and like... Oh, honey. That's right. <laughs> All right, you got what you wanted in the final week, hey. Well, anyone, anyone would want to get to the final yeah, week. I'm not going to okay. turn down the doors to do that, am I? I would have. Six forty-four p.m. There's a storm brewing for Scott. Oh! Yes! It's two and a half hours since Scott came out as a secret mole, and the housemates want to talk about it with Big Brother. Well, Scott's come clean about his little uh, mission. Well, lo and behold, you've strung another surprise on us, which doesn't surprise me at all. I was really confused, because I didn't really understand the exact point of it at first. People are feeling a bit deceived. You helped Scott reach the final week. I'm still a little bit confused. Another thing completely, utterly out of my control, again, and would have never saw it coming. Yeah, I do feel like a bit of a fool. It could have happened to anybody. I would never ever do that because I just think it defeats the purpose of being in the house. Dina's saying she wouldn't do it. Of course you'd do it. You've come on Big Brother to... Of course you would. <laughs> I wouldn't have done a Big Brother. Because it's not fair. It's not you being your true, true self. It's just being an actor or just being a zombie and and... I, I, I don't feel like it's much of an achievement. Well done, Scotty. Proud of him for doing that. How can you be proud knowing that you've got this far, but it was by instructions? Everyone's taking it so seriously, though. Like, everyone's analysing it. A lot of it makes sense, and it kept him out of the clear for a lot of things, and I could almost say it would be a little bit of an unfair advantage, too. The only thing is, I've always thought he's... I've always thought, like, oh, he's so nice, like, he's, he's not a bitchy person. But I don't know if that's maybe because he wasn't allowed to bitch or not. Obviously, the, the coaching and, and whatever must have helped, because he's the only one that hasn't been up for nomination. It's very, very bizarre that it's, that it's gone on for ten weeks. It's crazy. 
7.18 p.m. Big Brother thinks it's time to let housemates in on Scott's little secret. This is Big Brother. As you are all aware, Scott has passed his secret mission. The house will be rewarded with a party later tonight. Yay! Yay. Well done. Well done, well done, well done However, what housemates did not know is that Scott's secret mission started today. <laughs> what? <laughs> this afternoon, Scott was told that if he managed to convince housemates that he'd been doing Big Brother's biggest ever secret mission across the entire series, then he would be rewarded with a party tonight for himself and for the housemates that were fooled. <laughs> All of us. I'm yeah. a very good actor. <laughs> <laughs> Big Brother can now reveal that Scott convinced you all that he'd been on a serious long secret mission. Therefore, a party will be laid on this that? evening. Deception with a deception with a deception. Oh, Good out. <laughs> Big brother. <laughs> All the nonsense I've been saying today was an absolute okay. fabrication. <laughs> Was I good? Yes. Yeah. Have you been clicked in the place? You, everyone's like, oh my god, that explains that. Like, oh my, I can mm. see this now. And it's no, <laughs> it's nothing. <laughs> cool, it's the only thing I cared so about with your brain. <laughs> Smoke. Good job. <gasps> Thank you. <laughs> yes, party. This is so funny. Oh, he's particularly good at this task. Yeah. Mmm. Fuck it. <laughs> Here, take this prop. <laughs> now that you got this prop, here you go. Go along with the story. Yeah, and it was like, well done, Scott. Perfect. Your, it was, your mission has been complete. That makes you guys gullible or what? <laughs> <laughs> like, it makes you second guess everything you did, so. Yeah. But, not like I'm mad at him. And he does take a long time in the diary room all the time. Yeah, he gets <laughs> called in all the time. And he wasn't in a group. He was in a group. Yeah, but a smaller fraction of a group. I've just been pretending all day. No, you know what you I'm sorry, they made me do it for a party. Yeah. It was for a party. Yeah, and I was thinking, all these, like, big personality traits that you have, you were telling me that it's all been fake. I'm thinking, shit, what is there left to Scott? <laughs> <laughs> Seven forty-seven p.m. Earlier today, Scott won a party as he successfully completed a secret mission. However, Big Brother is about to get tough with the guest mm. list. Housemates. Oh, good lord. For fuck's sake. The living area is now ready for Scott's party. Okay. However, earlier today, on three separate conversations. Ashley, oh. Dina and Luke S all broke the rules concerning talking about nominations. Oh, fuck. At 12.59, Luke S said about Dina... Can't wait to nominate your ass. I want the ticket! At 2.10, Ashley said... Dina? She's already 100% done it to me, but... 100%. Oh, by all them three have. At 12.25, Dina intimated in code to Adam who they should vote for. Wow. No, didn't. I mean, yeah, there is a potential that all three of us could be out. Yes. But this, if we all... Um, no, did you get that? Yeah. Yeah, so... Um. As a result, no, Ashley, Dina and Lucas will not be attending tonight's party uh. and must not enter the living room until further notice. what you envisaged for your party. <laughs> Fuck. Well, Ashley, Dina and Lucas return to the I'm bedroom. Drink and drink and yeah. What is this? <laughs> You're <a> fucking... <laughs> 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 oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Hey, the fucking... No, I'm naked. Oh, I'm god damn it. <laughs> Ashley, <laughs> Dina and Lucas must return to the bedroom wow. immediately. They're going to be just getting some scans. Scans, they got no fucking pants on. <laughs> Get me one, <laughs> 
Man, that's bullshit, that is. Oh, this is really, this is really fucking pissed me off right now. I can't believe this. Well. That's... Uh, <laughs> fuck. Oh, my God! I can't... I can't look, I'm just embarrassed. Scott, look, look, look. Why leave me alone? What am I going to do? I mean, if there was some big-breasted ladies, I would enjoy it. Oh, my. <laughs> you only have to check out his? What about the other two? They feel left out. I've seen his bum. What? I <laughs> see. <laughs> I was... Are you going to have a rating? No. 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 See, I can't believe it. I'm not the I say to just yet. No. <laughs> this is fucking awkward. <laughs> fucking naked, <laughs> naked men hanging around me. <laughs> well, they chose well, didn't they? <laughs> <laughs> this is really depressing me. His neck is very stiff, that one, isn't he? I think they've got to go. They are in good shape, honey. That little one is. I was in better shape than him when I came in it. No, oh, for fuck's sake. Luke, why don't you say for Oh, fucking hell. <sighs> hello, Luke. Hello, Adam. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Where's the ladies? Turn around, don't pull. Oh. Oh. Right now. Oh, oh yes! Oh. This oh, is great! Yeah. Yeah, There's a um, three assless chap men in there. Big Brother is aware of that. Adam. Oh, okay. Just check it. I didn't know if they snuck past you and just got in here and got naked. <laughs> Can we have kisses? That's yeah. fine. <laughs> Ashley's staying next to the window next to the bed. So if the asses come near the back window, she can get a peek. So I just tried to lift up these pit pack things. Did she? Yeah. Sarah. It was like kindergarten school, tag, mm, you're yes, it, yeah. and chase me. Yep. <laughs> He's so hot. She's one feisty chick. <laughs> one feisty chick. <laughs> well, I don't so get nice. any escorting, do I? Oh my god, this is the best night in my life. Luke S is probably like, I remember when I used to be that big, been a big brother and I shrunk. Do you think Dina's annoyed she's messing out? Yes! She could give him some business cards. I, she, I, I wish yeah. she had some business cards. Yeah. I'm so angry. Couldn't hint anything. Well, you, well, you're gonna have to ask. You obviously said something for them to say it. It was the hundred million billion percent nothing to do with nominations. I'm a billion percent sure on this one. I, like I've broken the rules a lot of times and I've admitted it, but this time I actually haven't because I I, I don't need to. Hint anything. Do you want to come to that party? What do you mean? Dear me. Sora, I'm most annoyed at you tonight. Why? Taking my men away from me. Just three! Mm, How many do you need, Scott? Two! Well, examine. A few. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up. Nominations are revealed. The housemates nominated for eviction this week are. Ten seventeen p.m. Housemates are about to learn the results of the final nominations. Any housemates who are not nominated will be in next week's final. This is Big Brother. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> the housemates nominated for eviction this week are... In no particular order. Oh, okay. Ashley and Adam and Dina and Scott and These four housemates will face the public vote this week. Oh, hello. Oh, fuck. 
first time I've been in blue, and that's really weird. I told you, you'd be fine, honey. I don't think I am, am I? Don't you be fine, huh? though. What's happening? <laughs> no. You're not being fine, Luke. That's fine. Yeah, you, yeah, you're being fine. Yeah. No way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Luke, Fuck off. Yeah. yeah. That's it. You guys are in the We're final. We're in the final. Oh. Yeah. Well, you no way. Last nomination. We're in the final. Yeah, it's the last no, nomination. No, no, no. Yeah. 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 No way. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 I'm not We're in the final. I'm ready. No way. Are you in the road? Oh, my God. Yeah, you're fine. Are you OK? Oh, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. This is that fourth week, aren't you? Thanks for giving me a week off, guys. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, I'm fine. Dean? I'm fine. I knew it would be a... Good. I think Adam? I knew it would be a... Yeah, I knew it would be like this. 100% I knew it would be a... Mm. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. <laughs> 10.32pm. Today has been the, probably the most stressful day I've ever had in this ad. I and think, I'll, I think they've I'll, given me that task. It's the last seven people. I'm, 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 they've I'm, given me that task because they know very well I'll be going. You oh. don't, Scott. Oh, what? Are you joking? What are you talking Scott, about? I you don't know that. Given me a task. Scott, you don't know that at all. So yes, why are you talking I Scott? Do. It's not a bad thing if you're going. No. It's a really good thing. I've as just well. said, I've had the whole experience for three days, so yeah. I don't mind. Yeah. It'd be interesting to see, because Scott's never been. What? Scott's mm. never been up, so it'd yeah. be very interesting. He's going to find it tough, though. Dean could potentially be saved the fifth time. Mm -hmm. uh, you were two and Ashley third. Three. Scott's going to be feeling shit, though. I mean, it's, it's great that he's lasted this long without getting up, but the first time you're up is fucking shit. <clears throat> Eleven nineteen p.m. It's been one hour since nominations were revealed, and housemates are reflecting in their own ways. So last week together, mm. you know, could be. It's part of the experience. Could be. Never know. It won't be our last week together. What? It won't be our last week together. Why not? Ever. Huh? You speaking about ever? No. What? Yeah, whatever. I don't see you outside, am I? <laughs> I said it might be our last week together. I hope oh, it's not. Oh, shut up. Of course it ain't, nutter. But just think, you've been the person with the least nominations, eh? No, because Sarah's only had one. And I'm the person with the most. Hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah, you will be, won't you? Yeah. I suppose it's only fair that I got off anyway, haven't I? never been before so and i have been saying like how it is a weird and mm. horrible is like stressful thing not never being put to the public and not knowing what they think so yeah that'd be it that would be finally like oh, can't wait for the night and listening to the crowd and seeing what they're chanting yeah yeah see if this chanting gets got up because that will be oh, I won't care, as long as I can know a little bit beforehand so I can prepare myself, mm. like, booing or whatever, then that's fine. OK, sera, sera. This week, Ashley, Adam, Dina and Scott fierce the public vote. Who steers? You decide from a landline call 0901 616 17 and add the number of the housemate and from